Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Dr. Anton Reese, and I bring you greetings on behalf of the 8,500 students here at WKCTC. Are you ready for Night at Noon, the Solar Eclipse? Are you ready? It gives me great pleasure then to hand it over to Colonel Terry Wilcott, who will take us into space from Earth. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Reese. Hey guys, just uh, just one more warning. Don't look at the sun till it's totally occluded, okay? That's, I mean, without your glasses on. Of course, I hope everybody's got their glasses and keep an eye on it. Um, what I'm gonna do is I will actually make an announcement when it's safe to take off your glasses, then everyone should remove their glasses and that's when you'll see the corona and the total eclipse. And if we're really, really lucky again, of course, we'll see a coronal mass ejection on the horizon if our if we just happen to get lucky with the timing of those things on the sun. So anyway, enjoy it. Uh, glasses should be on. Don't stare at it. It really will damage your eyes until I give the call that says that it's safe to take them off and then do that. And then I'll put another call out just uh, as the sun is getting ready to pop back out again to slip your glasses back on and we'll see everything else in reverse. If you're, real, if you're really, really observant and really, really lucky, we'll see some colored shadow bands coming across this terrain here uh, very shortly. And they're hard to see, but uh, if you're really paying attention and you have a nice flat surface, maybe we'll see some of those if you look real carefully. Yeah, you should have your glasses on when you look at it uh, right now. Okay, let's have everyone put their glasses on. You might notice some of the insects are starting to chirp uh, as they think that uh, twilight is coming. <laughs> also, if you're staring right now, we'll hope to see a diamond ring. That'll be the very last bit of sun visible, and you'll start to see the corona around the rest of the moon. It'll look like a diamond ring, and then we'll see Bailey's beads as the sun peeps through the valleys and canyons on the moon. About two minutes to go. someone earlier it's amazing when we do see the diamond ring uh, it's interesting to know that that the sun shining out just from that one point before it disappears is 10,000 times brighter than the corona. <laughs> Keep those glasses on till it disappears. Get in there. There's the beads. There she go. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, yeah. let's take the glasses off. Wow. Oh. Wow, wow. Notice the stars that are out. Yeah, I don't really care about the 
like the poster. Now, March, March would be great. Yeah, off to my right, the uh, bright object up here, that is Venus. That's the planet Venus. Someone mentioned that if you look around, you'll see a sunset looking, the pink horizon all the way around. Time for the glasses, back on. And that's the diamond ring. Glasses on, folks. Did they come on? Yeah. We're noticing the street lights came on. Temperature dropped four degrees that they measured, so maybe more. We have someone that measured it. The temperature dropped at least four degrees during the eclipse. Thanks everyone for coming out. Enjoy the day. Plenty of food, fun, fellowship. Thanks again for visiting us here at WKCTC. And remember, it's not too late to sign up. I'm just saying. <laughs>